We sit in a, in a live sports uh, space, and so you can't get any more compelling stories other than live sports. So we cover everything from basketball to softball to Brazilian jiu-jitsu, um, and are expanding into a bunch more uh, over the next couple of years. But the majority of our business and the majority of our efforts are geared towards the cross-sport uh, advertisers who want to reach either athletes at all levels or sports fans at all levels or just have a general sports marketing uh, tilt. As our sales team was getting uh, more proficient at talking to advertisers and talking to more advertisers, we would get more data requests coming in. We had an aggregate overlevel view, but it was really disjointed. But Quantcast allows you to both look at individual verticals and individual properties, as well as aggregate everything into a kind of a company-wide, network-wide view. And so having the ability to do both, it's like go deep on a specific vertical, a lot of insights there, and roll everything up into one kind of aggregate view that gives a really good idea of our overall audience. It's having that flexibility is super, super important to our sales, uh, sales team. So why would um, an insurance company want to advertise on a track site, you know, a wrestling site? They need us to prove to them why they should spend money, why we have that audience that is geared towards that. That tells a story that advertisers want to hear. It's, it's data that's necessary to, to show them and to just really tell that story that this is the right audience that you should be in front of. So at the beginning of each quarter, we're obviously facing a number of directions that we could go into. And Quantcast helped us narrow that down to a, a number of actionable things based on our demographics. And one of the most interesting takeaways we had was we found out that Flow Rodeo's audience is predominantly female. You wouldn't typically think that that's a predominantly female audience, but it's 72% female. So we radically adjusted our content approach and we created like a series of content around what we can do to attract that audience and retain it better. Last year we were about 30% of the proposals we were sending out was to these non-endemic advertisers that reach across all of our sports. This year, and this is in line with our new strategy and how Quantcast is helping us out, that's increased to 60%. We've seen our average proposal size uh, jump close to 80%. If you didn't have those insights, you would go to a travel advertiser and our salesman would be like, hey, you should be advertising, reach our audience, speak to them, tell, us, tell them your brand message. And a marketing exec would be, well, why, why would we want to talk to a, to a softball player? We've never done that before. It's never, there's nothing around that. You have these insights that softball, softball players, you know, travel 30 days a year and, and stay in upscale like hotels, then that becomes a much more interesting conversation because it's not about the softball player, it's why these why this audience is traveling so much. When our sales team goes in with a data-driven story to tell to an advertiser, it catches their attention and makes them pay attention to what our sales guys are saying. Quantcast has helped our business because it has allowed us to be more effective and understand better who we're targeting. And in turn, we've seen more traffic, which leads to greater brand exposure. We've seen more subscriptions, which lead to more revenue. And it has really helped us grow our vertical and make it what we want it to be. If I didn't have Quantcast, I would do my job very poorly. We need it to answer a lot of the questions and check a lot of the boxes within RFPs that come to us. I mean, we need some sort of tool to provide that information. I don't know how else we would win in these RFPs without a tool like Quantcast.